It's okay. Let me be the one to save you. Huh? Perhaps I acted in haste. So swiftly you sensed the dimensional distortion. Oh, meddlesome wings. You who defy the stars. You will sleep within this child, until I have further need of you. <laughs> Come, the stars await. And we mustn't keep them. The true beginning stirs. had become a dragon and vanished into the somber skies. His roar, which echoed like a distant peal of thunder, electrified me with sadness. Uh, can't believe it. I thought if we beat Angra Mainyu, we'd be free to go on our merry way. No kidding! Why did it have to go off and become Bahamut? Right. In which case... Hey, what are you thinking about, Rowan? Looks like you've got all your gears whirring. It's starting to come together now. Especially if she used a Mind Sealer on him. The Mind Sealer is what they used to rob Lyria of her free will. What does it have to do with Bahamut? Everything. Lilith and Bahamut, destruction and rebirth, everything is linked. How about giving us the gist? Essentially, it comes down to why Lilith failed to wake Angramanyu 15 years ago. I heard the Sky Realm's Bahamut appeared after sensing an overwhelming astral presence. Perhaps that was more than rumor. You call that the gist? I'm even more confused. Sorry. Fifteen years ago, Lilith summoned Angra Mainyu. At the same time, Bahamut manifested to face her. 
But this was not the same Bahamut you all know. Let us call it Bahamut Versa. It sensed the unfathomable power of Angra Mainyu and consumed it. Stopping Lilith in her tracks. But now... Perhaps, to remove Bahamut from the picture, Lilith trapped the Primal inside Id, using the Mind Sealer. Okay, but that doesn't explain why she suddenly freed Versa. Does she want to wreck the skies, or what? She once told Id that she would destroy the world to bring about its rebirth. Versa is more than capable of forcing reincarnation upon the Sky Realm. In any case, we know one thing for sure. If we leave Versa to its own devices, it will be the end of all life as we know it. You've got to be kidding! How are we going to defeat a World Crusher? And what's going to happen to Id? You aren't asking us to kill him, are you? <sighs> Not gonna happen. Thank you. He doesn't deserve death. Huh. Still got a debt to settle with that punk. Can't let him off so easily. How do you know it's still in there? Even Bahamut's got nothing on it. Exactly. Guy with a stick that far up his butt? Even an apocalyptic dragon couldn't push him down. Even if we can't get through to him, he'll survive a beating. He trounced us, right? <sighs> I've been around for a long time, but you Sky Dwellers never cease to surprise me. I never would have dreamed that a single crew could save Tempeel, or pacify Excavalion, or defeat Angra Mainyu. But, you've taught me that it's not longevity or physical strength that's important. It's the power of your heart. You have my complete faith. I believe that nothing in all the world will keep you from saving your friend. It's settled. We snap Versa like a piñata till it coughs up in. Yeah! I compliment any bouquet. Superb! <laughs> well now. Hmm. Well now.
could use this. Yoink. Looking for that special loaf? Look no further! I've got all sorts of items! Uh, what's your heart? <laughs> right! But... Thank you so much! <laughs> Great! What's in the market for? Ooh. You better nab those limited items before they. We go. have a wide selection of sigils!
Will you take this one? Be on your way. Ready. I'll look after you. Your wish is my command. Stay behind me, everyone. No falling under my Oh, for Sky's sake! Let's mess you up! Come on! Fire! I've got them! Do it for me! Ready yourself! They're open! We will prevail! You take the lead! Stay at the ready! You got Caution before valor, as they say. What do you think? There! Bolster the ranks! Healing light! What do you think? You want more? I need your power! Time's up! Can't keep up? Beautiful, aren't they? No more! You soar high, Captain. There's more where that came from.
Come in handy. Hmm, not bad. Well, shall we call it a day? Butterfly alights. Huh. And just in time. Enrage the tigress. Supper.
claws. Gather. Huh? The butterfly and scatter. Night fall. Foam on the sea. Light is a float. Dawn flight. Huh? The pond settles. Scatter. Huh? The cloud break. Letter. On the hills. Come. Scatter. The tide rises. Float. Succumb. The butterfly is scattered. Three flutters. Scatter! The tide swells. All is swept away. Night fall. Drill? Which weapon shall I strengthen? Let me show you what my master has taught me. Thanks for coming. something? This one? Well then, so long. What's in the mic? Whoa. You better nab those limited items before they fly off the shelf. Thanks for the business. Good day. Let's see. What do you say? Will you accept it? Be on your way. Heaven smiles upon Earth's bounty. But you will let us pass. Frozen blade! Cut them 
Tempering your weapons? I'll unlock the power within. What do you have on you? Which weapon shall I strengthen? Please select a right stone for me to engrave. It's a great success. Let me show you. It's perfect. Always strive to leave it to me. Let's move out. All right, let's go. This world is precious. I mean, even the god of destruction can't bear to lose it. Our bodies might be mortal, but our hearts are infinite. Though he's in a dark place right now, I hope it doesn't lose sight of that. But even if he does, I'll open his eyes again. I, this crew, will never abandon someone we care about. The sunrise spills over the Grand Cipher as we rush on the winds, chasing the sorrowful cries of a faraway dragon.
help you. Me too. Thanks for the support. I won't waste it! The spell is perfect! And yet... It seems the binding is only half effective. <laughs> Captain, the rest is up to you. You must save it. while it's still in effect. I'll maintain the spell for as long as possible, but we're in a race against time. Hold nothing die. back! Okay, this is the last fight! You better fight till you drop or it's a goner! What do you see? The spell! <laughs> come on, come on! Muhammad Versa represents both creation and destruction. Aubergine wings drive the evolution of all beings. Life gives way to death, and death begets life. Our attempts to intervene with this process may have far-reaching consequences. I want to believe in the limitless potential of Sky Dwellers. I want to believe you can rewrite even the laws of reality. Keep going! I owe you one. It's getting really bad. Sad and empty. We haven't known each other for too long, but I can feel it. He wouldn't want things to end like that. We just have to save him. Excellent collaboration. There it is. Seriously, who cares if you're stuck inside Bahamut? I'll bust you out myself if I have to. It, you were betrayed by the woman who raised you, made into a dragon's vessel for 15 years. And yet you, a mere mortal, survived. If I should fail to rescue you, I don't think I shall ever forgive myself for the rest of my long, long life. In the past, I had nearly existed. It wasn't until you Sky Dwellers let me into your hearts that I learned what it was to live. Unlike Immortals, you are capable of change and growth. All I want is to be a part of that. To help you build a glowing future as an Astro. I am also to blame for the failures of my people. And I swear to you now, I will set things right again. Level. We need more firepower! I think you mean dragon power. Lyria, do you feel up to summoning Bahamut? Okay, <laughs> just give me some time. It's the light of the apocalypse, the fire of doomsday. Its power is transcendent. If the attack lands, all the skies will be obliterated. Please, stop this! We know we don't want this, Ed. So hurry and wake up! Oh, I can't see! You hold me the charge! But it 
has already stored up considerable energy. Quit trying to fry us, dagnabbit! Everyone, gather around me! Get Kaliria, now! I'll keep you all safe, I promise! Painted by Versa's destructive urges. But it seems his body and soul are still in one piece. And that means there's still hope. If you can sever the spiritual shackles that bind him to Versa, he'll come back. I got him. Still has a 
hold on in. But now that he's human again, you have one last chance to rest him completely free. I don't know what to believe anymore. You should at least believe in yourself, Rufus. Think back to when you were fighting to protect the sky. Did that feel like a lie to you? No, because that was what you actually wanted. But I wanted. Whenever you feel confused, you just follow your heart. The bright lady is scary, Rufus. At least you'll know you're being true to yourself. Anything happen to you or our world. Our journey can't end here. It's not gonna. We're gonna kick some dragon tail and go on sailing to the end of the sky. Oh, yeah. Your time's up. Burn it. Absolute zero. We'll do it again. it sooner no use running anymore I am who I am Absolutely amazing. You've suppressed Versus Core and driven it back to its home dimension. Is everyone safe now? Thanks for everything. <laughs> you can buy me some apples on the way back. Huh? We're still not done. Leave 
leave this to me. Wait, where do you think you're going? Forgive me. <laughs> Kids these days, you two are totally <laughs> nuts. Be back soon. Let's roll into you, Bernie. <gasps> you okay, man? Where are you? Hmm. Good question. Someplace far away? <laughs> hey, this ain't the time for jokes. He and Bahamut are trapped on another plane. Think of it as a sliver between dimensions. Still, considering his transceiver seems to be working, For now. Sadly, I think my time's almost up. The line's going to get cut earlier than I'd hoped. Thought I'd still be able to open a gate from here. Guess not. Isn't there anything we can do? Sure, just stay calm. No need to worry about little old me. I'm Mr. Fixit, remember? There's no jam I can't get myself out of, you know. I'll make it. Oh, One last thing. So until I get back. where we bumped into Roland when we first arrived in the Zega Grande Skydom. I have to atone. Huh? For Mother's crimes 
And mine. Come on, no need to beat yourself up, kid. That's right. We couldn't have resolved this without you. so easy. Well deserve an apology. Come on. <laughs> Cut the formality. We already said it was fine, right? Yeah. <laughs> one of us now. Got me? Never forget everything you've done. Never ever. <sighs> and when we find Roland, we'll give him the thanks he deserves. We've met so many people in the Zega Grande Skydom. New friends? New allies. We saw a man torn in two by family and betrayal. We were saved by an immortal who found beauty in our changing world. Through loss and adversity, our resolve brought Lyria and I closer than ever before. Yet this story is far from over. A good friend is still out there, waiting for us to come get him. And as for our journey, there's still much to see. To the ends of the skies where the stars reside, someday we will reach Asgard. 